everyone. We would like to talk to you about Turtles All the Way Down by John Green. If you're watching this, presumably, possibly you have not read this book, but we are here to convince you to do so. I'm Jessica. I'm Christina. And you're watching Game, Game of, of Tomes. Tomes. Five stars. Five stars. Five stars. Five stars. It's one of my favorite books of all time. Yes, I agree. Is it? Yeah, yeah. your favorite one yes. This book follows the story of a girl named Aza, yeah. who is suffering from OCD, yes. and it just kind of follows her and her best friend as they try to kind of solve a mystery, but mostly you are in the head of Aza, who is dealing with her OCD. Which is um, an illness of which John Green suffers from, um, so it is in fact an own voices book, which yes. I really appreciate. Yes. Yeah, I do too. It made me cry. Yeah. Multiple times. It made me laugh. Multiple times. It made me cry and laugh at the same time. Not me. Oh. <laughs> but it did me. <laughs> okay, so I I personally don't suffer or know anyone who suffers from OCD, but looking from the outside in, I thought this was actually a very realistic portrayal of that. Obviously, it's own voices as well, but it kind of showed, like, the ugly side of it. Yeah. It didn't romanticize, like, oh, I have to have something in, like, color order. It was, like, ugly and thrown out there and... Un and scary. And sc scary. It was scary. Scary. Which I, I would imagine if you if you have um, an illness in your brain telling yeah. you that you need to do something that you know you don't want to do or that you shouldn't do or that's, that's bad for you. That's terrifying. Yes. Yeah, that sounds terrifying. You, you know... You know that the thing that you are doing is unreasonable or won't help harmful. You. Yes, yeah. but you have to do it. Yeah, it just like consumes you. Yeah. Yeah. I also really like the fact that it I think all teenagers should read this book because I felt like the way he ended it with Yeah. Yes. It gets better. Like it gets yeah. better part was amazing. Yes, the ending was uh, it's just like all I think all teenagers need to know that whatever you're going through you, you can get a handle on it yeah and you'll get through this I thought that was absolutely wonderful yeah I thought the way that John Green uses technology in this book was yeah. great and just a very natural way teenagers use um, technology all the time yeah we use technology all the time when you want to learn something you go to the interwebs and you'll read all about it yes I mean, you know what I mean? Yeah. So we actually have signed covers. I, 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 along with 200,000 people. Yeah. <laughs> 200,000 other, 200, other people also have signed copies. But, you know. In but we feel really cool Yeah. to have, have one also. And it's purple Sharpie. Mine is red. Beautiful. Uh, yeah. We went and saw them. Uh, there was a, if you're a Vlogbrothers fan, I think you would enjoy this book yeah. because there are a lot of things that happen that they talk about in their videos, like the Tuatara, yeah, like pizza, yeah, like uh, uh, other things, yeah, <laughs> that they've also talked in their videos. And I was just all the time reminded of John and Hank um, whilst reading this, yeah. and uh, I thought that was really cool. And uh, it was so much fun seeing them in person, and they did a. They had a guest, <laughs> Professor Frogman, I think is what they called him. Who the is this? <laughs> well, let me help you out with that. Next slide, please. Phylogeny, also called phylogeny. And uh, I, they were just so funny, but also like they got on a very serious and personal topic as well. And I could really appreciate that as far as authors go. You know, sometimes they don't always talk about their personal lives a lot and mm. I feel like I think this was a very personal book for him yeah and so yes. I, and I think he was brave to um come out and speak about that and yeah his personal experiences and mm -hmm. and so and when you have laughter um that makes the sorrow so much sweeter yeah you know and so much deeper yeah and, and um laughing through tears is my favorite emotion yeah it was I it made me actually appreciate, I haven't watched a lot of Vlogbrothers videos because I didn't know about it until Jessica, and it actually made me appreciate, like, their brothership a lot more because, okay. like, you could tell that, like, they're close. They're so close. Yeah. And it's just, we got to sing <laughs> All Star by Smash Mouth. That was a lot of fun. Uh, Sweet Caroline. Yeah. Without the ba ba ba. <laughs> and, uh, yeah, it was just, it was a lot of fun. It I laughed, I cried, yeah. 
It was fantastic. It was beautiful. Yeah, it was. Um, and I had a great time with you. I did too. I had a great time with you. Uh, we drove two hours back home late at night, blasting Alanis Morissette. <laughs> and, and Spice, Spice Girls. Girls. <laughs> And, uh, what a man, what a man, what a man, what a man, a good man. Anyways, it was, it was, a, um, it was a lot of fun. Oh, uh, and it was at the Historic War Memorial Museum. In Nashville, Which, Tennessee. um, is a beautiful place. A uh, lot of famous people oh, have been there. Yes. Historic is yeah. heck. Said, should we turn back from my camera? And I said no. It was the greatest mistake of my life. Look at this. Cut out. <laughs> Awesome. Yeah, it was a beautiful place. Yeah, so anyway, our recommendation if you ever see them go on tour for anything, you, you should definitely go check them out. And you should read Turtles All the Way Down. Yes. By John Green. Thank you for watching this video. When you play the game of Tums, you read or you die. Come here, friends. Social media links in the description below. And we hope you're reading a great book. Bye. Bye. Go get Mickey Mouse. <gasps> Mickey Mouse. No, 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 Mickey Mouse. You watch your language.